update new this morning. An act of kindness that stands to help thousands of people. Yeah, WCPO 9 News reporter Allie Kramer joins us live from the Free Store Food Bank with all the scoop. Good morning, Allie. And good morning, guys. Hey, look, usually the Free Store Food Bank is a one stop shop for people in the community. They serve thousands of people every week. And uh, thanks to some local health care workers, they're actually going to be able to provide more than food to those folks. Now, I want you to take a look. These are some of the Crothel health care workers that work at Cincinnati Children's Hospital Medical Center. There are about 500 of them and all, and the group actually is in charge of making sure the hospital is cleaned and sanitized. They frequently work on projects to benefit area nonprofits. And last month they decided to do a sock drive for the less fortunate, asking each employee to bring in a new pair of socks to donate. Well, it's been a difficult year for everyone and something that was and really team leaders wanted to do something like this because they thought it was inclusive to everyone. Well, that quickly snowballed as different teams and different departments. They started competing against one another to see who could collect the most socks. By the end of it, they collected, listen to this, 4,238 pairs of new socks. I think our coworkers were a little concerned because our conference room was taken over. <laughs> we had to store all the socks, count all the socks, and then we had to figure out a way to deliver the socks. And so we piled them in a huge car, van, truck type thing, and they were about coming out the windows. I mean, we, we were scared to open the back door. <laughs> And I kind of told Suzanne there, I said, OK, yeah, I'm sure you had to load up the car. No, that thing was stuffed to the brim. You saw that video there. I mean, even the folks at the free store food bank down here were shocked when they came and just saw exactly how much they had. So, you know, the sock drive was really just for their company. But if you're so inclined to make a donation, hey, the free store food bank could really use it. And it's actually really easy to do because of COVID protocols. All you have to do is drive up, pop the trunk, and they are happy to help you out. Guys, Allie, I'm just wondering, you know, um um, it's the free store food bank and so normally you'd have a donation drive where you would be collecting food. How did they come up with collecting socks and so many of them? Well, yeah, so usually they work with, uh, you know, a lot of area nonprofits. And so they kind of thought, like, what's something attainable that everybody could do and be able to participate in? And just buying one pair of new socks was something that they thought all 500 people could do. So, you know, what kind of an odd thing. But then it kind of became this sort of fun joke. And they were singing Sock It To Me. You know the song? Uh -huh. I, will, <laughs> I will spare you singing it this morning. <laughs> but, uh, but, yeah, like just something kind of fun and different. And so they kind of encourage, you know, other companies, other groups to do something very similar. Yeah. So fun. Step so out fun. of the box. I don't think um, I would get socks at any other time in my childhood except Christmas. You know, you got mm -hmm. the box of socks. Right. So it's, it's exciting when you get yeah. a new pair of socks. And necessary. Yeah. Yeah. Allie Kramer, thanks so much.